Speedrunners absolutely broke my game. Last year, I released a difficult platformer called Step by Step, where the gimmick is the player runs automatically. Hitting a wall makes him turn around and keep running, and he has to get to the top of a map that has no checkpoints. On average, it takes new players 8 to 16 hours to beat it, but the world record by Clark is a mere 5 minutes and 23 seconds. How? Well, with some crazy shortcuts I had no idea existed. Like in the third area of the game, where the player is supposed to run all the way to the left, turn around by jumping off this power wall, and run back to the right. But a speedrunner named Turnip found out that actually, no, you don't have to do any of that, because with a pixel perfect jump, you can hit this roof and turn around early. And here in this desert, where once again you're supposed to bounce off this power wall, run over past the bone, and bounce off of the sphinx to turn around, except with a super precise jump, you can do this. Even towards the end of the game, there's a difficult and punishing wall jump where you have to fall downwards and jump off the wall, but speedrunners found that with precise timing, you can just drop from above and hit the wall. These tricks and so many others are super difficult, but if you want to try them yourself, step by step is 20% off for the Steam Spring Sale, and the link is in my profile picture bio, because it caught me by surprise when...